I'm here with a singer, guitarist, and owner of a new piano. And unfortunately <laughs> for me, yeah. I'm a United fan. Right. <laughs> hey Tom, how are you? I'm very good. How are you? I'm very good. Are and you it's... a City fan then? No, I'm no, I'm a Liverpool fan. Can't oh, you see okay. on my head? Of course, yeah. I missed that mile off, haven't I? Yeah. I hope we are okay. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how's the new piano? Very good. Yeah, yeah. I've wanted one my whole life, and I had one that was like I kind of inherited, but it was 150 years old and so broken, and I spent. I think I bought it for 150 pounds and then spent 600 pounds getting it tuned because every three weeks it would go out of tune. So trying to make music on it was quite difficult, but yeah, the new one is very lovely. Yeah. Is it your first time in Slovakia? Yeah, it is actually, I believe so, yeah. What do you think about the weather right now? You, I mean, you don't seem to be... <laughs> I mean, it's hotter than I thought it was. I didn't pack for 32 degree weather and it's quite humid, but it's very beautiful, very nice scenery and uh, yeah, lovely place. You'll be playing on the biggest stage ever in Slovakia. What's the biggest stage uh, that you've played in your career so far? Oh, wow, that's a great question. Uh, I think probably the John Peel stage at Glastonbury, which is probably around 20,000 at full capacity, maybe something like that. So yeah, what is it today? I don't know, but uh, it would be probably 40,000, I think. Ooh, damn. Yeah, well, look forward to that. <laughs> uh, your second studio album called I Am is coming out in September, if yeah. I'm correct. Uh, what are you if it's called I Am? How, how would you describe yourself in few words? I mean, a troubled individual, that, that's for sure. No, I mean, yeah, it's, it's complicated. I'm a complicated person, but there's a song on the record called I Am. And uh, if you want to figure out who I am, that, that song explains pretty much everything you'll need to know. A majority of uh, Slovak people, I think, uh, know you through the Just You and I mm. and uh, Leave a Light On. But which songs of yours do you think deserve more attention? Oh, great question. Um, there's a song that I wrote on this album called Lifeline, which we released a while back. And uh, it's a song that, you know, addresses kind of mental health issues and especially in like younger people. And I feel like that deserves a bit more attention than it got because it's an important subject. So if people want to listen to that, <laughs> they can. It's called Lifeline. And how was the flight yesterday? I, I saw that you that it was delayed by five hours. Oh my god. We left the hotel at 11 a.m. and we arrived here at 1.45 in the morning. So it was a very long travel day. But it was kind of okay. I mean, we were just in um Geneva airport like running up and down escalators and then the whole airport closed and it was just us and the people on that flight so yeah we had a bit of fun with it we tried to do our best but obviously yeah, a bit of a bit of a long travel there so your tips for uh, staying at the airport while delayed flight are jumping on the elevators or, I mean, we were, or esca <laughs> escalators we, we were we went into just full boredom mode you know I felt like I completed my phone yesterday so tried to get some funny content that was about all that we could do really I mean everything was closed there was two vending machines and a toilet that's that's about what we had to work with so it wasn't much let me get back to the football not yeah. soccer sure uh, for a bit uh, did you watch the first Premier League game at Friday no <laughs> I'll be honest because I was I'm from Manchester everyone automatically assumes that I am a huge football fan because most people from Manchester are City or United but music takes up pretty much 98% of my time uh, so yeah football's not really on the radar for me of course I, I watch the Euros and stuff like that um, but you know only a bit later into it when it looked like we had a chance I was like okay, okay I can get involved with this but uh, yeah I'm not a diehard football fan to be honest okay Tom, thank you so much for your time in two weeks our clubs are going to clash each other at Old Trafford yeah. so I'm wishing you the least of luck <laughs> and, <laughs> and have a great show Tom thank you very much I appreciate it